You wish. King Charles slaps on Meg's face after denying has his coronation's royal oath speech instead of Willie. The coronation day may be all about King Charles, but that doesn't mean the rest of the family won't get a chance to shine as well, with Prince William being heir to the throne, Prince Harry's children becoming prince and princess, and Camilla Parker Bowles becoming queen. And with great titles come greater obligations, as King Charles will show when he arrives at Westminster Abbey to take his royal oath. According to a royal staff member, Meghan added a further condition after confirming her absence from the coronation, King Charles must allow Prince Harry read the royal oath instead of Prince William in order to accept him as a royal deserving of the throne. Although King Charles mentioned his younger son in a public speech two days after it was confirmed that Prince Harry would be attending his coronation, he still refused Meghan Markle's ridiculous request because Prince Harry was still a non-working royal and the Duke of Sussex has no right to a royal oath without the new king's permission. According to Express.co.uk, the British monarch attended the Royal Military Academy Sandhurst for the 200th Sovereign's Parade, to see more than 170 cadets who have undergone training to become army officers. The King said, as he addressed the crowd, that as a father of two alumni of this academy and he knew the immense pride they would be feeling. The UK's Daily Express newspaper described his remarks as a major olive branch extended to Harry by his father. Moreover, Prince Harry and Prince William will be separated at King Charles' coronation, and insiders claim there won't even be a camera shot of the brothers together. The brothers' relationship is at an all-time low, and organizers are reportedly keen to make sure there aren't any public rows on the big day. So much so that the princes will be sat so far apart that cameras will not be able to get a direct shot of the pair together, according to the Daily Express. Any potential smirks, sideways glances or awkward stares won't be broadcast to the entire world. Due to the tensions within the royal family, Harry's arrival at Westminster Abbey will be meticulously crafted down to the exact minute. The palace will be hoping to avoid any awkward confrontations, so are allegedly putting Harry several rows back behind the senior royals. It's believed he will be sat with other non-working members of the royal family and those he has no bad blood with, such as Princess Beatrice and Princess Eugenie and their husbands. It has been rumored that some royals will give Harry the cold shoulder, as many cannot forgive him for his repeated accusations against the family. Referred to as Willie in Spare, Harry accused his brother of plotting with their father and revealed details of that sensational reported fight. William allegedly pushed him to the floor during a row at his Kensington Palace home, leaving him with a ripped necklace and bruises. Harry said William and Kate encouraged him to wear a Nazi costume to a fancy dress party, which sparked outrage in 2005. The Duke discussed being told by William to pretend he didn't know him at Eton and his brother's alarming thinning hair. Harry is not expected to take part in either the King's procession or the coronation procession to and from Buckingham Palace, nor will he be on the Buckingham Palace balcony. According to insiders, Harry was cutely aware that the historic occasion will be pretty much the most important day of the King's life. And he realized that he would have deep regrets if he did not turn up on the momentous day. The announcement now ends months of speculation about whether Harry and or Meghan will be at the coronation. In a statement, the palace, Buckingham Palace is pleased to confirm that the Duke of Sussex will attend the coronation service at Westminster Abbey on 6 May. The Duchess of Sussex will remain in California with Prince Archie and Princess Lilibet. According to sources, Harry wanted a summit with King Charles and Prince William to discuss their issues before the coronation. A source told the Mirror, Harry has been very clear and his position hasn't wavered, he isn't going to come if he feels the atmosphere will be as toxic as it was during the Queen's Platinum Jubilee and funeral.
you wish. King Charles slaps on Meg's face after denying has his coronation's royal oath speech instead of Willie. The coronation day may be all about King Charles, but that doesn't mean the rest of the family won't get a chance to shine as well, with Prince William being heir to the throne, Prince Harry's children becoming prince and princess, and Camilla Parker Bowles becoming queen. And with great titles come greater obligations, as King Charles will show when he arrives at Westminster Abbey to take